Dr. White? No. He's the drunken sodder on the corner. You can get his attention. Tell him I quit. All this ire on him. Not worth getting caught up in it. I have a family. Dr. White. Yes? My name is Connor. And what can I help you with? Another quote for the broadsheets for you to twist against me? I'm here to make you an offer. Don't you know who I am? I'm the doctor the British have been slandering all over town. White death. No? I was given your name by my friends Warren and Prudence. Prudence is with child and requires a doctor's hand. Prudence is pregnant? Ha! They've been trying for years, it seems. Maybe getting away from Boston is exactly what I need. Not the right gift. Bad news. She did not like the flowers. She tossed them aside. But Prudence was certain. I knew Miriam was not the type for flowers. I will uncover this mystery myself, Norris. All right, but please don't let her see you. She will think I'm bizarre.
might appreciate a new knife. That blade has seen its prime. Norris, I looked around her camp and it seems she needs a new hunting knife. The one she is using has seen better days. Oh, oui. That seems more right for her. I'll think on it. Merci. Norris, how is the mine? Is there anything worth your time down there? Most definitely. Copper, Connor. And a healthy amount of it. Excellent. I am glad. I've been meaning to ask, is Norris a common French name? My real name is not Norris. It's Maurice. But you told me... I did. When I arrived in Boston, people started calling me Norris. And I got tired of correcting them all the time. Just before we met, I had been talking with that lady at the pub. She said she liked my name, Norris. I decided to stick with it. Would you prefer I called you by your real name? Nah. Everybody here knows me as Norris. Miriam included. Names can change, but people stay the same. Isn't that right? Connor? Very true. What is it, Prudence? I feel silly bothering you with this, but Warren's taken a year to market in Boston. Could you round up the livestock for me? I've tried, but this baby in my belly takes the wind out of me. Of course. I will see to it. Faster than they look. Ah, the things I do for this place.
Thank you, Connor. I could never have managed that. <laughs> it was my pleasure. Are you well? I am. And I couldn't be happier. Warren and I have been waiting a long time for this. And if truth be told, we could not dream of a better place to raise our family. Dr. White called upon us earlier. A very unexpected surprise. One that has put both Prudence and I at ease. The village is growing, and a healer's services will benefit all. Indeed. Ah, it's hard to explain how I am feeling right now. My wife is resting healthy and safe, full with child in our warm home. The community is kind and attentive, and the land is rich. It was not long ago that such a life was only a dream for us, Connor. All people deserve to feel safe and free. Hopefully a day will come when all men of the colony should share your perspective. But it will be a long, hard road. That much is certain. <laughs> 